Go Granny, go Granny, go Granny. You already know what it is. My name is Janice and welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today I'm gonna to be showing you guys my t-shirt collection. Um, yeah, that's what we're gonna be doing. I have so many shirts and I just wanted to show you guys, you know. A lot of people ask me where I get my shirts from because I have a lot of them. I'm gonna show you guys all of my shirts and I'm gonna tell you guys where I get them from, all that good stuff. Um, but before we get into the video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit that bell notification to be notified when I post more videos because the girl is being more consistent now. I am posting every single week, probably multiple times, but I'm just filming back to back to back to back. So I got mad videos for you guys. Um, <laughs> so yeah, don't forget to also comment down below what your favorite shirt was that I showed you guys and also what you guys want to see in the future because I want to, you know, I want to hear what you guys want to see more of so yeah let's get right into it um yeah let's do it okay so the first shirt that i'm going to be showing you guys is the one that i have on now just the golden girl i mean let's show you guys a clip so i don't have to do too much movie right now but um yes yeah, the golden girl shirt yeah it just has the golden girls on it i got it from ebay it was like i don't even know i can't remember the prices of, of all these shirts so i'm not even gonna say them i'm sorry but yeah, I got it off of eBay. It wasn't more than like $22, I don't know. But yeah, I got it off of eBay. I love this shirt. Um, yeah. All right, so the next shirt is this one right here. It is Power Line. You're a real one if you know what movie this shirt is from because I don't know, like this. Yeah, um, so you're a real one if you know where this is from because I know everybody's not gonna understand and know where it's from, but if you do, we're here. Yeah, so this is Powerline, it's from an extremely goofy movie. Yeah, it's from an extremely goofy movie. I had to think about that for a second. Um, I really love it because it's like a tour shirt, even though like this is a non-existent character or whatever. Like it's a cartoon, duh. But like, it's a shirt. It looks like it's from like a tour. Like it has on the back, it has um, all these tour dates. It has the year, 1995. Shout out to my 95 babies. I got this from Hot Topic. I don't know if they still have it or not, but um, yeah, it's one of my favorite shirts. I've never even worn it before, but it's one of my favorite shirts. I've never worn a lot of these shirts. Don't judge me, I'm sorry. Like, But yeah, so I love this shirt. Okay, so this shirt, oh. I don't even know what got on it, but I think it's like made up or something. I need to wash it. Um, this is, you can't see it from here. It looks like a regular white shirt probably on camera, right? From this distance, but um, as you can see from the video, it's very glittery, it's very pretty. Um, yeah, like you don't even need jewelry when you wear this shirt. You can just throw this on with some like jeans, regular white sneakers or whatever and you'll be good but i love this shirt so much it's so like pretty i got it from um g suwu he's on instagram you can find him and see all of his stuff i got this a while ago so i don't know if he still has it but um it's good quality it's like heavy like when you um hold it it's pretty heavy so this is really good quality i haven't seen any of these um Little rhinestones fall off yet, and I'm hoping that it stays that way because this is one of my favorite shirts um, that I own. So, yeah, let's, let's hope it. I don't even know how to wash it, you guys. Can you comment if you know how I should wash it? Because I don't want to put it in the regular wash, and I don't know how that whole. I don't know how to wash it. So, if you know how to wash it, or if you have any idea of what I should do or how I should do it, please let me know. Because I did not remember my shirt. That shirt was like $90. So we're not trying to ruin that, okay? That price I can remember because it was expensive, but I'm not trying to ruin my shirt. So if you can tell me what I can do, that would be appreciated, thanks. 
So the next shirt is this shirt right here. I got it in a thrift store when I was in Florida on vacation with my family. And I just thought it was so cute and it's so different. Like, I mean, obviously I'm not in a cult. Don't try me. No, I'm not. We don't do that over here. But <laughs> I thought it was really cute because it has like the old timey cartoon um, look on it. And then it's just like random. Like what? Like <laughs> it's a bunch of children singing with like weird stuff in the background. And I just thought it was really cute. So and it was like five dollars. So I was like, why not? Let me in it. So yeah. It is so hot down here, but I can't turn on the AC because you won't be able to hear me, so. Okay, the next one is this shirt. I got it from, um, I can't remember the name of the, um, the place I got it right now, but I'll put it somewhere on the screen here when I do figure it out. But um, yeah, they have like this main theme that's like 40s and shorties, which I absolutely love because it reminds me of the 90s and like all that stuff, like, you know, people drinking 40s. But yeah, it's kind of simple, but I love it still because it's cute because you can wear it at really any time. It's not like thin or anything. I got it oversized because that's how I like it. I like some of my shirts to be bigger and some of them to be smaller, but um, this one is perfect for me. And as you can see, it has a little um, embroidered 40s and shorties on it. And I just thought that was really cute too because um, I just love that. I, but yeah, it's kind of simple, but I love it still because it's cute. Okay, so this shirt <laughs> is Mr. Rogers. No Mr. Rogers slander should be tolerated, so. Yes, Mr. Rogers, I got it from, I don't even remember where I got this from, I'm really sorry, like, I, I don't, I really don't even remember, maybe it was Hot Topic, maybe it was somewhere else, but as soon as I saw it, I had to get it, because I love Mr. Rogers, he's the sweetest man to ever walk this earth, and I just thought that this shirt was perfect for me, because... I mean, I didn't really like that show when I was growing up because I thought it was kind of boring, but now when I look back on it, I'm like, oh my gosh, like, he was so right. He was so sweet, so nice. Positivity and kindness, all of that. Let's start trying to work, okay? All right, so. This next one um, is just like a, I think I got this in Hot Topic 2 or, no, this is from Forever 21. I got it for, um, for Christmas. My sister got it for me. But yeah, it's just like a... What are those trucks called? Monster truck. It's a monster truck on here. And I just thought it was cool. I like the fire. I like the... Like, I just think this, this shirt is really cute, so... Okay, so now this is from Goodbye Bread also. Again, it's oversized. It has um, F and S on the front. 40s and shorties. And then it has cute girl on it um and then on the back it's just more intricate and colorful and pretty and stuff um yeah 40s and shorties what is this players wanted okay skip the wine and the candlelight bad decisions good times yeah it's just 40s and shorties baby okay so this next one is also from forever 21 it's in sync, 90s and early 2000s. Well, if you were born in the early 2000s, you really didn't come up on this. I'm sorry, um, but like if you're if you were born in the 90s, you know like in sync when we're like five, six years old, we used to be singing that all the time. I still do. I love in sync so much, which is why I got this shirt. And yeah, my favorite was Justin. Is Justin? Who's your favorite? Let me know. So this next one is just says Hot Wheels on it. It's real simple. Um, I used to love playing with Hot Wheels when I was growing up because uh, before my sisters were born, it was just me and my older brother. So there was already so much boy toys in the house that I just didn't even care to play with Barbies. I was just like, okay, I'll play with the, the Hot Wheels and the Power Rangers and all that stuff. So still to this day, I think Hot Wheels are the shit. And yeah, so that's why I got this shirt. So this one is from a company called Home Delivery. Um, 
they're based in the uk so their shipping prices are a little bit high sorry um but yeah i think this shirt is so cute um it has like so the shirt is called vices on the website and it's just because it has like a bunch of stuff that i guess people do that aren't that smart or great or whatever um because they're dice on here for rolling dice or gambling or whatever um there's pool pool balls and then a girl on a motorcycle and like a drag racing um flag thingy so i'm guessing that's what the theme of this shirt was but even if it's not i don't care this shirt <laughs> this shirt is so cute um And it's oversized too because i wanted to be able to wear it um with like just shorts on or like kind of like a dress so yeah i got it in the medium which is what most of my shirts are because i like oversized shirts like i feel like if they have something on them automatically like you should get it a little bit bigger if you want it to like not feel like it's like too tight on you or whatever but that's just my opinion so this next one i don't even i can't even tell you guys where i got this from because I wouldn't really suggest getting it from there. I think it's like throwback tees or something, but like, I mean, the shirt is cute. It's Destiny's Child. Um, but if you look up close, the graphics aren't that great. And I don't know, I just wouldn't really suggest it. If you want to buy from there, go ahead. Like obviously it's your money, but um, it's cute from far away. Yeah. And then just another, this is from the same place that I just said, except it's in white. Yeah, this is just the white version of the red shirt page. Okay, so I got this one at a Summer Walker concert that I went to with my sister back in December. Um, it's just her thing. And then the, the tour date. Oh my god, fun fact. <laughs> um, when I went home from this concert, she like posted a photo like 10, 20 minutes after she got off the stage. And I commented on it and she replied to me. So. And then that happened again two more times and then she inboxed me. That was so cool. So this one is from the same place that I said before, the throwback tees place or whatever it's called. Um, this is a Lauren Hill. This probably is a lot better actually than the Destiny's Child one, so I don't know if maybe that was just a bad shirt, or I don't know, but um, yeah, this one is way better. And I think this would be really cute to wear with some camo pants or something, um, just like a simple cute outfit. And you know, Lauren Hill has the voice of an angel, even though she'd be late to her concerts. Um, Okay, so now when I say that this is one of my favorite shirts ever, I mean it. <laughs> this one. It says, I'm Christopher's grandma. So random, like, so random. But I was in a thrift store and I saw it and I had to have it, even though it was more expensive than like everything else in, like that I could it was more expensive than anything I bought from that place. Like honestly, for a, a shirt, it was eighteen dollars. But there was only one of them, and I don't know where else I would find. Like, this is so cute, and it looks like. I mean, it's never been worn because it's not like stretched out or anything. So literally, like, this is probably a brand new shirt. I don't know where else I would have got it from if I didn't get it from there. And even if I did get it from somewhere else, it probably would have been more expensive. So I just figured, why not? But yeah, this is really, like this is, um the material on the words are like velvety. And it's not like it's like printed on or anything. It's like, I don't even know how they got this on here, but I think it was worth it. <gasps> okay, so this is the last shirt. And this is also one of my all time favorites for obvious reasons, but It's me. <laughs> um, yeah, I got this custom made because I just really wanted a shirt with my face on it. 
I just really wanted one so I um, got it done on custom ink like I found this t-shirt place that I really like and I messaged them and asked them like if they knew a graphic designer or if they could tell me there so that I could um, ask them to make it for me and they gave me the, they gave me it which it was really really nice because I don't know of any company who would be like, hey, like this is my graphic designer, like go ahead, like use them because if I wanted to start my own business, I wouldn't expect them to just like give me their source or whatever. But they were really nice and I just really wanted just this one shirt. So I messaged the guy and he was like, Yeah, tell me what you want. Like we work together and we figured it out and he made the print of it and then I just um, uploaded it on Custom Ink and had it made into a shirt. <laughs> It's me. Um, so those are all my shirts. Okay, so yeah, those are all my shirts. Um, I definitely am going to be getting more. Like whenever I see a shirt that I like, I just immediately buy it because I'm very crazy about my t-shirt collection. Like I love shirts. I love, um, I don't know. Like I wasn't ever really allowed to have posters when I was younger in my room. My dad was like crazy about tape on the wall or putting holes in the wall or whatever um so uh, i would figure out other ways to like i don't know have what uh, what am i saying basically shirts are like po the my version of like posters like if i couldn't have them up on my wall then i would like figure out another way to be like hey like this is what i like and that was in shirts so i just became crazy about like getting shirts and like having that instead of having posters if that makes any sense but yeah but yeah thank you for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe also hit the bell notification um but yeah that was my t-shirt collection thank you for watching and i'll be back with more videos soon so just let me know what you guys want to see so that i can you know so we can figure that out let me know down below which one was your favorite shirt out of all the shirts that I showed you guys. And I will see you in my next.